Welcome to ESL time. Welcome to part two of the Christmas. First sign. Elf. Now this one you're just going to fingerspell. E-L-F. You can describe it too. Um, especially if it's a kid that doesn't know what an elf is yet. You'll have to explain, so you might. Elf with pointy ears that helps Santa, or however you describe it, it's fine. But E-L-F. Family. We're going to take our F for nine hand and palms out, fingers and thumbs touching each other, and then you're going to make a circle, like a horizontal circle, to where your palms are in and it comes out. Palms are facing you. Friends are X's, so a bent one, are going to intertwine, and then you're going to flip your hands and do it again. Friends, friends, more friends. Gift or present. Again, our X's, you start with yourself. And then you give to the person that's getting it. Gift. It could be a gift for you, and then it would come towards you, but gift. And if it's in general, you don't know who it's going for, then it's just straight out. Gift. Grandma. Our five hand is going to come up kind of like mom, tap our chin, and come out and bounce. The one coming out once in an arc used to be the sign for mom and they we have changed it a little bit but grandma is mom a generation away so you do like the McDonald's arch with it. <laughs> grandma. Green. Take a G for green and we're going to shake it a little bit. Green. Palms to the side. House. Our five hands, fingers together, are going to make the roof of the house come out and down like the sides of the house, the walls. Jesus. Our fives bent middle fingers are going to touch each palm one at a time. Um, if you remember I explained the middle fingers sometimes means um, like empty, bald, naked, that kind of stuff. So it's the um, where the nail is the holes. Jesus. Lights. Now, there's different signs for light. Or lights for Christmas. We're going to do this like little flashing, twinkling lights. Your middle finger and thumb, like the number eight, are going to um, rest on your chin and then you flick out. Lights. Milk. Milk. Your C goes to an S. Used to be like you're milking a cow, and then it turned to one hand, and then it's just, it doesn't move as much. Okay, so now you can sign milk and cookies. We'll talk about going to Grandma's house, and I will see you for part three soon. <laughs>